Good morning, Wildcats. Welcome back to a great spirit week of learning. Um, today is pajama day. So I'm going to make sure that we're following the other dress code piece where the short, too short, too off the shoulder. Make sure we're following that, but you wear sleepwear today. Hopefully everybody took advantage of that. Um, usually my sleepwear, I do, uh, you know, I, I'm always thinking about school, so I always wear my ID and dress like I'm going golfing. That's what I do all the time. So, all right. Hope everybody's having a great week. We have job sport coming up. We have uh, college go week. It's just a lot of good stuff this week. So let's get to it. All right. Today is September the 25th and it's Monday, 2023. And these are your morning announcements. Don't forget Wesleyan Middle School is an avid school wide side of distinction. And the mission of Wesleyan Middle School is to reveal the genius of each wildcat through a culture of joy, respect and excellence. We believe every person deserves to be seen and to grow. All right, let's make sure we're all cat ready. Everyone, our lanyards and IDs around our necks, our binders and our student organizers are with us. Our backpacks, fanny packs, and purses are in our lockers. Our hats, sunglasses, and hoods are off. And our, and listen, any over-the-ear headphone as well you guys want to wear around your neck, those also are in your lockers, period. They should not be out anywhere. Also, our phones should be in our lockers as well, of course, and blankets never make it here. All right, it is Spirit Week. And this is the week. So Monday is pajama day. Tomorrow is college day for college go week. On Wednesday, eighth grader, you're getting job spark t-shirts that morning. So you'll be able to wear those. And sixth and seventh graders dress for the job you think you want to have a career for later on. Thursday is throwback Thursday. We'll also have elementary kids at our football game, hopefully. And then Friday is homecoming at North Central. So we're going to be wearing our black and red. All right, today's schedule. We have advisory, and then we have block six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. That means it is a white day. It's a white day. All right, our focus again, keep focusing, writing in your student organizer every single class. Let's clean up Westland, make sure our language and our uh, messes are cleaned up. Make sure before you say anything, is it true? Is it helpful? Is it inspiring? Is it necessary or is it kind? If it's not, don't say it and don't post it on well, any social media. I'd also let's, let's clean up West Lane by making sure we're keeping germs at bay by washing our hands after we use the restroom and also coughing and sneezing into our sleeve to make sure we don't spread germs. We have a shout out. In fact, I bet you our next three days are shouting out from this teacher. Um, Ms. Barry would like to sh shout out her four and nine block math class. Ms. Barry's shout out is for her period four nine class. All students in the classroom are always ready to work when the bell rings. They have uh, the agenda's filled out, their do nows are completed, and they ask clarifying questions. Nice job, Ms. Berry's four and nine math class. Those are the same kids, but they know who they are. Nice job. All right, don't forget at West Lane, there is zero play fighting, zero shadow boxing, zero two for flinching, and zero nest slapping, also cheese necking, also known as just being a jerk to someone else by slapping their neck. Don't do it. Um, pass protocol, again, as each student gets it out, an average of one pass a week. You also have 75 minutes throughout the day to use the restroom during passing periods and lunches. No passes are in the first 20 minutes or last 20 minutes of class, so we got to get settled, get taken attendance. Everybody's in, in the room. Sit at your correct tables and facing your center in the cafeteria. And stay in your seat and have your ID. Talk about IDs here in just a second. All food should be eaten in the cafetorium. No food should be eaten outside the cafetorium. The bell does not dismiss you from class. Your teacher does. Breakfast students, you must report directly to the cafetorium off the bus to eat breakfast. Don't forget our motto, Cada Wildcat, Cada Dia Mejora, which means every wildcat every day gets better. Let's talk about IDs. All right, everyone knows I have been blitzing IDs the last couple of weeks. Um, we've got a few more to print out today, but I'm going to start saying as of um, uh, tomorrow, once we get everything out, you don't have your ID, and I call for it, it's a detention. And also at lunch from here on, I mean, starting maybe next week, you don't have your ID, what will happen is your lunch will be, instead of like going to the end of the line, which you still will do, your line will be a, you'll have a sack lunch. I'm going to work with uh, our cafeteria to do a plain old sack lunch for that because we need to have our IDs. I've given many of you, all you've gotten one from us, and some of you've gotten two. And then if you want to get a new one, it's $3. It'll come with the lanyard, the ID, and the ID, and the holder. But we've got to make sure we have these IDs. We're not passing them out for our health. They're for you. And again, teachers as well, feel free. If they don't have their ID, most people have gotten one. They don't, go to do, they don't get a pass from you either. 
And that's got to be a rule that we've got to follow. But you need to have your ID at all times uh, in here at school. And we can't figure that out. We need to figure that out. All right. Everybody have a great Monday.